See, we're acting all tough, but a Giga shows up and I'm out the door. <laughs> no, thank you. No Gigas. <laughs> Hey, Geeks, Riley here, and thanks for joining me today as we play some more Ark Survival Evolved. We're back on the Geeks Primitive server. In last episode, we lost our little buddy Sprocket. May he rest in peace. <sighs> so I thought about giving ourselves uh, another Tech Raptor, like we got over here. Because we've got some good Tech Raptors, we've got some good eggs for them. But um, Webby is another patron on the server, and uh, he borrowed one of our Megatheriums to get some high-leveled uh, Megatheriums going for himself. And he actually brought us a good mating set. So I think... I think we're going to actually give ourselves a Megatherium to go along with uh, our next journey since they don't tend to attract too much attention and they're stupid powerful. So uh, we're going to get these guys hitched up. Uh, there we go. And if you could hitch up. And then uh, I want to actually give you guys a quick little um, uh, real life update too while we're doing this. Behavior, enable wandering. All right, you guys doing your thing? Good. So... Um, if, uh, you know, I, I don't talk about it too often, but if those of you like the patrons and the people in the discord, you guys know that I've been remodeling my house for a while. Uh, the kitchen is mostly done, but the next big step is I'm <laughs> I'm doing all of the floors at the same time in my house. So every floor in like the entirety of my house is going to be the exact same flooring. And it requires a massive amount of work to get everything prepped for that. Um, I've done almost everything I can get away with, uh, aside from the computer room so far. So my, like my little recording room where I media server and all that stuff said, I still have to tear that all apart. Uh, and I've been holding off on that because I know it's going to take time, uh, and it's going to make it hard to do recording. So the install mark for my flooring is next week. So I've kind of, <laughs> I kind of waited a little longer than I probably should have. But uh, I'm going to actually start tearing stuff apart here. I'm going to try to keep the computer up as long as I possibly can. Uh, but since they're doing the entire house, it's not like I can actually move uh, my computer to another room and not have issues. I'm going to have to keep it down for a while while I'm doing this no matter what. So uh, I'm going to hold off. <laughs> as long as I can, but I wouldn't be surprised if you guys don't see any videos from me for just a little bit while I'm getting through that process. Um, I didn't want anyone to kind of worry or freak out about it. It's fine. I just, you know, it's it's a big project. It's the last really big section of the project I need to do um, that's going to require me to kind of have like a lot of time away from my computer. Uh, but I just kind of thought I'd let you guys know. Uh, yeah, if you don't see anything from me, I will be in the Discord. I have my phone. I, yeah, I'll still have my computers. They just won't be I can't, like if I have to tear everything apart, I can't put them back together until the flooring's in. So we're going to see how it goes. <laughs> <laughs> but yeah, so sometime next week, that'll all be going on. Did you poop or give me a baby? You pooped, right? You got a gestate still, I think. Uh, <laughs> so that's the that's the, the big deal right now is, uh, you know, whoa. All right. It looks like you guys are done. That was real scary. <laughs> like, I'm just saying, like, that's um, a freaky way to end that out is all I'm saying. <laughs> Disable wandering. 13 minutes of gestation. Uh, I'm not going to keep you guys here for all this because they have to gestate and then it's got to be, you know, it's got to be brought up to uh, to full health and uh, maturation. And that's going to take a while. So I'm going to actually do that stuff in the background. I just want to make sure I let you guys know up top what's going on so you don't have to wait until the end of the video to know what's happening. But yeah, if you don't see any videos from a rally for, you know, from older rally here for a week or so, it's probably because I have to get all that stuff reset up once it's all done. Um, and it's, it's, it's a big, it's a lot of stuff. It's a lot of stuff to do. So, uh, yeah, I will be back once these guys have given me a baby and the baby is ready to go. Bye. Okay, any second now. Just have a little, a little floofy baby. <laughs> I, at the end of the breeding stuff or gestation, it's always funny that it seems to, like stick. So like it's it's definitely not nineteen seconds still, but like it just takes <laughs> it takes a while for it to go through, which always kind of cracks me up. Oh, uh, huh? Huh? get some berries. Okay, go back. Floof, baby. Hey, come on. Oh, was that it? Yeah. Oh, did we get twins? Come on, mama. Come on, mama. Let's go. We did. Come here, you. Wait, wait, wait. Come here, you two. Oh, I got little floof baby twins. Yeah, let's give you some berries. Let's give you some berries. All right. Uh, come here, floofy babies. Uh, let's go so we can see you in the sunlight. Come on. 
<laughs> I always love when you get like the big creatures like this. And they got little tiny babies that make really big sounds. Oh, look at you guys. <laughs> yeah, little floof babies. Okay, uh, we got a boy and a boy. Two boys. All right, floofy boy men, guys. <laughs> <laughs> oh, they're gonna work out so well for us. Good job, look at you little snowballs. Okay, Whew. I'll bring you guys back once they're matured up, and we'll take them for some leveling. <laughs> All right, guys, it's the wee hours of the next morning. The heal power is going on from our bio mod, and our two boys are ready to rock and roll. Meet Yeti and Wendigo. So these will be our two uh, protector slash... Uh, traveling partner deals. These guys are going to be crazy. I'm going to go ahead and ride Wendigo. Let's go ahead and put uh, Yeti on follow. Actually, let's make sure to uh, behavior. I want to throw on attack my target. Okay. You should be the same thing. We'll just make sure behavior attack my target. Okay. So we're going to head out into the morning with these two bad mamma jammas and we're going to just tear up the, we're gonna turn the place up <laughs> just in case you guys didn't know this is one of the reasons i love these guys totally stupid <laughs> these guys are dumb i was gonna tell you that the, the best thing in the world is like look at these uh, like the dillo and raptors and stuff will not attack them so like we'll shoot over this way this raptor even when it's done killing that guy it will not attack the megatherium unless i attack first uh which i will in just a second here but i do love that you can just kind of like go around here and I have to worry too much about these things because they won't actually attack unless unless you attack them first and I can harvest hide and meat and everything with these guys <laughs> all right so first thing we're gonna run so we've got 10,000 health already which is pretty good uh stamina is not too bad uh our weight's pretty good I'm actually gonna pump movement speed right away um I want them to be relatively fast well you got five levels aren't you fancy <laughs> So I want them to be pretty fast because they're going to be, you know, a good, a good source of transport across the island as we're messing around here. Uh, I'm going to go find, uh, I'm going to go find ourselves another, uh, one of the, uh, explorer notes in a little bit here too. So we can kind of get really leveling on these guys, but I want to show you guys that was the idea. I'm going to, I just want to see if there's some Brontos or something down here. Um, cause these guys should take a pretty good beating and put out some good damage at the same time. I just got one more level for that. Okay. Come on, Yeti. Let's go. Go find ourselves some Brontos. There's a whole bunch of Stegos over there. That'll do. Oh, there's Brontos for sure. Okay. Yeah, Megatheriums are, are tough enough that I feel pretty confident taking on things like, uh, like Brontos and Stegos and stuff. No problem. Uh, once we get some levels in... I would go for Rex too, no problem, I think. So, all right, let's go see what we got over here. What level are you, buddy? It's a little dark. I'm going to turn this up in just a second here. Where's this? I know there's another big old Bronto someplace. All right, so, uh, Gamma, oops. Gamma 3. Let's go ahead and put this away. All right, Bronto time. Let's do this. The thing too is I should I try to like if I can I always try to look for like bugs and stuff first because you get that megatherium uh, damage buff when you hit the bugs first, which is just silly. What's up there, other brother Bronto guy? You unhappy? Don't worry, it's cool. I got some for you too. <laughs> there we go, buddy. We got these stegos. We'll take these guys down to put in some work, boys. Let's put in some work here. And the tech one too. You guys are done. What do we get? Just two levels, huh? All right. Well, we'll take two levels. Well, we got five, I think now. Okay. 130 with speed on this one. What's this guy again? So we're a little bit higher in speed in this one. So once we're going to just get a little bit more speed because I do like to be able to kind of just run. Uh, and then we'll actually start pumping stuff into melee damage and stuff too. So, ooh, is that a Carno? Hello, Carno. 
Think you're all high and mighty? I don't think so, buddy. Bam! What up? <laughs> you gotta love Mega Theories, man. These guys are beasts. All right, I'm gonna do some killing, some damaging. I'll bring you guys back. All right, I found me an Explorer note. We got ourselves a Scorpion here, which will give us our bug killing rage mode. We got some Brontos. Let's do this. <laughs> Yeah, you guys got nothing against one to go and yet a the Carno up there too. You're next, buddy. You are next, Carno. We got a Raptor in here. Kill that guy. Another Raptor. What do you got? Psh, goodbye. Oh, you getting smoked by a bird? Don't worry, I'll take care of you. And you. <laughs> Raptor, go away. That's why these guys are great. Ooh, what's that bright red over there? What was that? Is that a Dodic? That's like super bright red. Nice. Level six. What is it with like the best level creatures or the best color creatures are always like super low level? That sucks. Get some more bug here. Hey, where, where are you going? Oh, hyena downs. How you doing? <laughs> Fools. <laughs> okay. Well, ooh, is that that's a Rex or a Giga? <laughs> Cause a Rex we would take on. A Giga obviously we would not. Is that it over there? Where'd you go, man? It's a Giga. Goodbye! <laughs> See, we're acting all tough, but a Giga shows up, and I'm out the door. <laughs> no, thank you. No Gigas. <laughs> all right, so I thought we'd head back towards uh, the Hidden Lake, because I think some people... Oh, hey. Holy crap. <laughs> you can see Moonshine's right here. I think that some people are actually uh, already building their little shops, and I kind of want to go see what's going on in there. <laughs> we almost ran right into Moonshine. That's pretty funny. Oh, Bronto. I'm feeling... I'm feeling... Given... Ooh, a Rex. Okay, we definitely want to go take on that Rex, though, right? What do we got? Level 102. I kind of want a bug first. Let's go find a bug. We're going to take on that Rex. Uh, I got some good levels on uh, on Wendigo here while we were uh, out and about getting stuff. I think, I, you know, 30-ish levels, I think. I don't even remember now. I just want a bug, guys. Give me a bug. Omega Nerna. Titanomirna. Something. Give me a tasty bug. <laughs> All right. I'm going to find a bug. I'm going to eat that bug. I'm going to go eat that. Oh, there we go right here. Okay. All right. Now, we'll go get that Rex. Give yourself a little bit of extra oomph. A little oomph. Come on, Rex. I hope you didn't get close enough to Dusty's. Ah, you're right there. Perfect. Hey, buddy. How you doing? Ha, 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 ha. <laughs> you ain't got nothing, son. <laughs> I won't take on a Giga, but I'll take on a Rex. <laughs> All right. Let's go ahead and uh, cross on over here and get over to uh, the Hidden Lake and see what's been uh, what's being built over there. Uh, 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 uh. Did I make it? That little trap door apparently didn't like us too much. Good? Okay. Into the hidden lake. <laughs> but yeah, so uh, the whole point of the, the the actual hidden lake area in here is to uh, to kind of give us a place that like the tribes could kind of meet up. Come on, buddy. Go a little, little drop down here. Ooh. Yeah, you'll be fine. It's so hard to see in here. All right, yep, so I think that there's a couple people, a couple of tribes have already started building. Yep, oh, there's one right now. Oh, so there's two? We got two in here. Uh, uh, all right, let's... <laughs> we'll come back up to this one in just a second, because the other one looks a little bit smaller. Just to see what's going on real quick. So, yeah, the idea is that everyone will kind of have, like, little huts and stuff set up. 
uh, and kind of, you know, offer their wares essentially. So Sabres, Megatheriums, and Quetzals. Uh, right now is who we'd be talking to to get that. And actually, I wonder if Webby's in there because 286 is what these boys were when we first got them. What do you have to know when to go? Let's get another. So we've got 554 uh, melee. We're up to 3,000 on weight, and we're up to uh, 1252 for health. So we get another one of these guys in there. Good boy, Wendigo. Uh, now, uh, Yeti didn't get the, the same buff uh, that we got with uh, Wendigo when we found that uh, that thing. The uh, Explorer note. So, he didn't get to do anything too crazy. Oh, can we actually go in here? Let's double check that before we go. Okay, so they have to unlock the doors. <laughs> so, uh, yeah, if you guys, if, if patrons are building here, unlock your doors. All right, boys, I'll be right back. You stay here, Wendigo and Yeti. Let's go check out this other one up here real quick. I know it's raining and beautiful. Okay. I'm digging it. So nothing up on the uh, on the billboard yet. I like the general shape here. Got some otters in there. How much is this otter in the window? Uh, so we go in here. Got a nice little bench out here. Oh, this door's open. Sweet. Oh, oh, oh. Payments to the Hunter's Guild. Oh, this is the one that uh, Cryo is part of. Uh, so payments go in here. Uh, leave note for Thyla with tribe name and Thyla count and cords. So it looks like they're doing Thylas. And then place uh, payment in small storage box by ice boxes. So uh, I'm assuming this will have stuff in it at some point. Uh, spare blueprints. Oh, they got like extra blueprints people can just snatch up over here? I'm sure they gotta pay something. I don't see anything about how much things cost, though. <laughs> what up, chicken face? <laughs> I know it's supposed to be a phoenix head, but this is very nice. I like it. So we just gotta get some pricing to see what's going on here. Got our little buddies up here. Little otters. Very nice. So yeah, uh, the idea, like I said, though, is everyone's gonna kind of build a little place like this, you know, to uh, quote unquote, offer their wares. Oh, <laughs> looks like Zombie Ent is rocking and rolling over here. We've got another one startup over here. It looks like too. I just saw it peeking out of the trees here. Um, I don't know if it's actually been built yet or if it's just getting started. Looks like they're just getting started. So we'll have another one up here. This is gonna be cool. All right, guys, I think we're gonna call that an episode. We got ourselves two Megatheriums to replace Sprocket, which was, you know, as much as I'm, I miss Sprocket, it was definitely a trade up because these bad boys are the brutal one to go, you beast, you. All right, so don't forget, um, it's gonna be a little bit probably. <laughs> I'm gonna hope to kind of get some stuff done before uh, I have to take a break, but I don't know if it's gonna happen. There's a lot of flooring left at my house to remove, so uh, I'm gonna get to some real life work. <laughs> You guys, keep keep the arc fires warm for me while I'm gone. I'll miss you. <laughs> but yeah, it won't be too long. Maybe a week, maybe a week and a half. Hopefully, I'll be back to get into some recording. Uh, I'll have a nice new floor throughout the whole house. It's going to be amazing. All right, thanks for hanging out, guys. If you've enjoyed the episode, feel free to drop a like below. You can always subscribe for more content, and I will catch you on the flip side. <laughs>